everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you how to stop Windows 11 from installing any update. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to pause the updates in the Windows 11 Update Center. So to do this press the Windows button then select the settings icon and afterwards make sure to click on Windows Update on the left pane and then on the right side you have an option under more options to pause the update. So you can just click on the drop down menu and choose to pause from one week up till five weeks. So if you click on it you'll see that the updates are now paused. Otherwise you can just click on the blue resume updates button if you want to start the updating process. Another useful solution is to stop the Windows Update Services. To do this press the Windows button then simply type services.msc and select it as an application from the search results. Now as you can see the list is quite big, so if you want to find the specific service just click on a random one then simply type the first letter of the service that you're looking for. In our case it's W from Windows Update. So now if you scroll down you will find Windows Update then double click on it and select the Stop option. Afterwards in the Startup type drop down menu just select the Disabled option then click on Apply and OK to save the change. Another useful solution to stop the Windows 11 update installation is to use Registry Editor. To do this press the Windows button then simply type Reg Edit and select Registry Editor from the search results. Now in here you have to navigate to the following location, H key local machine, then double click on software, afterwards scroll down until you find the policies key and expand it, then expand Microsoft and lastly expand Windows. Now in here you have to create one key with one sub key, so right click on the Windows key, then select new and hover over the key option and click on it. Now this key should be renamed to Windows Update, so type in Windows Update. Afterwards you have to create a sub key for this Windows Update key, so right click on it and select new and hover over the key option and click on it. Now this key should be renamed to AU. You just have to press enter to create it, then on the right side of the screen of the registry editor right click on an empty space, hover over new and select a new D word. Now what you have to rename this D word value to is no auto update, so make sure to type in no auto update. Now the last thing you have to do is simply double click on it to modify some values inside and in the value data make sure to type in from 0 to 1. Now you can just press on the OK button to save the changes, restart your PC for the changes to take place. And lastly, another useful solution to stop the installation of these updates is to use the local policies. To do this, press the Windows button, then simply type gpedit.msc and select Group Policy Editor from the search results. Now in here you have to navigate to the following location, Computer Configuration, afterwards just double click on Administrative Templates, then expand Windows Component, in here just scroll down until you find the Windows Update folder and double click on it. Then on the right side, then move on the then simply move on the right side and double click on Manage End User Experience. And lastly, just double click on Configure Automatic Updates. In here, the last thing you have to do is simply tick the box next to Disabled and click on Apply and OK to save the changes. And that's it. Plenty of solutions to consider. As usual, for more information and details you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.